Liz, I have to talk to you. You've been told to stay away from me. You swore in court you'd not come after me. Liz, look, I've no intention of harming you. That's a God's honest truth. Why do you keep walking out on me? Would you mad up this is a very good No, it's okay, Vicky. Talking to him's no use. Dad, leave it, will you? Do you mind if I use your phone, please, Jim? Yeah, come soon, Louis. Liz, will you just be reasonable? Just... Let me through, Jack, will you? No, I, I don't think so, lad, no, no. Look, there's not going to be any bother, all right? I swear to God. I just want to talk to my wife, no, Jack, all right? Have a drink, Jim. I'm Laws Bartley. I don't want a drink. I want to talk to my wife. Do you think I'm entitled to do that? Yeah, well, that's between you and her, and I'm not going to interfere, but I can say who comes in my house. Now, have a drink, Jim. Yeah, cool down a bit, Dad. Have a drink, like Jack says. I'll go and have a word. I see what I can do. It's the pub at the end of Coronation Street. Yeah, that's right. OK, thank you. Have you rang a taxi, Mum? Because I was thinking, look, why don't you just go down to Granny's in Southport for a couple of days? Just give him time to cool down. I phoned the police. Well, it won't take any notice of me, so let them sort him out. You haven't phoned the police. You can't do that. I've just done it. Now get that down your neck, Jim, lad. Dad, Dad, quick work. But you're going to have to clear off, mate, Sharp. She's just rang the police. No, she wouldn't. I'm telling you, mate, she just has. No, she might say she's... I mean, did you hear her ring the police? Well, no, not exactly, right, but... Right. Dad, I don't think you should be here just a minute, you know what I mean? Look, I'm in my local having a quiet drink. That's all I'm doing, all right? Liz, Andrew tells me you've rung the police, is that right? I have, yeah, they're on the way. <laughs> Why have you done that? I'm not going to hurt you, love I just want you to get you to talk to me. There's nothing to say. There's everything to say. Not from where I'm standing. It's all been said, and you did your talking with your fists. Come on, Dad. I've got the car outside. Come to our place, eh? I'm not going anywhere. Here! What's she doing behind this bar? She shouldn't be here, eh? Come on, she better stay where she is, Fiona. <sighs> Come on, Jackie. Will you say my wife needs protection from me now, or oh, what? Man, I'm saying now. I just don't want any bother. Look. Come on away, Dad. If, you, if you're still here and the police get here, then you're in serious trouble, aren't you? He's right, Dad. Come on. Liz, look, all I want you to do is sit down with me for five minutes. That's all I want. Be reasonable. I've tried that. Being reasonable do not work with you. I'm not going to hurt you, love. I promise you. That's the first promise I want to make you. It's all finished, all that. No, no thanks. I've been there, done that. Got the bruises. There's a police car out here. Police? Come on, this is your last chance. Look, I'm standing here trying to talk to my wife, OK? Oh. Is there a Mrs. McDonald in here? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's me. I phoned the station. Because he's hounding me and there's a court order against him doing that. Right. Are you willing to make a statement to that effect? Yeah, yeah, I am. He's been stalking me all day. He followed me to the corner shop this morning. We've met before, haven't we? Up, which is not yes, so we have. Then I walked down the you got to arrest me the last time. Doorstep. That's right, and so now I've got to do it again. Now, come on, mate. He hasn't Stay out of this. It's none of your business. Oh, yes, it is. He's me dad. Look, there doesn't have to be any trouble. If you just come down to the station with me. Look, all I'm trying to do is speak to my wife, OK? Now, if that's a crime, I'm as guilty as hell. Come on. Right. OK, Liz, this is what you want, eh? You happy now? All right. Well, I'll tell you this. In future, have your quarrel somewhere else, not in this bar. Have it flaming police coming. Vera, Vera, leave the girl. She's upset. I'm upset! Oh, come on, let me have a word with you. You know they'll lock him up now, don't you, Mummy? They'll take away his bail and they'll put him inside now until his court case comes up. How can you do that to him? I'm frightened of him. That's how I could oh, do it. come on. He's hit me. He broke into the house to get at me. Well, I've had enough. He won't take any notice of what I say. Well, he'll have to now, won't he? And don't you stand there looking at me as if it's my fault. 